Hello everyone, my name is Cami and welcome to my channel, Key to Disney and Fragrance. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, if you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so, so much for coming back. On my channel, we do mainly Bath & Body Works and fragrance content with a sprinkle of Disney and lifestyle content. But in today's video, we have my second Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale haul. Honestly, I went to like five or six stores. So I'm going to put in this footage now. This is all the new footage that I have gotten um, before, um, like the first week, uh, minus the first day, since you guys already saw that. So we have some 50% off stuff. Some price drops did happen. I went to the Bath and Body Works outlet in Pleasant Prairie. But to be honest, it was really bad. The outlet did not have that many good things besides one 75% off cologne. So that was pretty cool to find. They had one little thing of $2.00 wallflowers i took the last two of them they had a three dollar section of the same fra fine fragrance mist that's been there for like months but yeah the outlet really wasn't it but you'll just be seeing clips right now while i'm talking yeah nothing too special some 75 percent off soaps while that's going on with the clips i do want to talk about at the store i went to today up in um kenosha wisconsin I found a, what was it, a Fiji White Sands antibacterial mist on the 75% off table. I got up there and the associate's like, ooh, this is an MOS item. I can't sell this to you. And I was like, bummer, because I really wanted it. But it wasn't the end of the world. I do have um, three bags and one thing in a box. And I think... That is probably all the clips by now that I'm talking so let me see um let's see here okay so we went to the mall we went to a mall and this was on the 75 percent off table wait no this wasn't the mall location at the mall location i didn't get anything um normally they have good stuff at that mall but they didn't this time this was at a standalone store it was on the 75 percent off table and then it rang up for that like 350 and then there was that coupon in the app for $2.99 Wallflower. I was like, whatever. <laughs> uh, and I wasn't too worried about it because it was the only thing I got. So my total at this store was $3.23. You guys know I have that $500 gift card, so I wasn't really too concerned about it. But I did get a Wicked Vanilla Woods in the Wallflower. I do really like Wicked Vanilla Woods. So I was excited to find it in the Wallflower, even though it wasn't 75% off, which is weird because all the other Halloween stuff has been ringing 75% off um, besides the Wallflowers, apparently. But this is Magical Vanilla, Glowing Ember Wood, uh, Glowing Amber Wood, not Ember Wood, Amber Wood, and Enchanted Pink Pepper. But yeah, it's, it's fine. I wasn't too mad about it. Um, so we have that. That was the only thing I got at that store, and that was on the 28th of December. Then the next store I went to, I got one thing, but it's amazing. They even have the box for it. The associates at the store were so excited for me. They were like, oh my gosh, let, them, let me get the box. Let me get the box. Let me get the box for you so you can take it home in the box, which was so nice because it'll be nice for me to put in the basement and the less chance of it breaking. But now I got to try to get it out of the box. 
because the, the styrofoam fits so good in here. Let me see. I don't want to break it. Oh my goodness, it like will not come out. Come on, get out of here. Okay, got it out of the packaging. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I don't know where my receipt went actually. Um, let me try to find my receipt really quick in my purse that I have next to me. I remember how much it was though. So if I can't find my receipt, it's not a big deal. I do try to save my receipts though. So when I do like my end of my haul for the end, I can get, oh, here it is. I found it. Nope, this was from today. That's not the right receipt. Hmm. I don't know where it went, but I know how much this was. Okay. You guys ready? Are you guys ready? If you follow me on Instagram, you already saw this and I put it on my community page, but this fortune teller um, globe was 75% off and I love her. Look at it. It changes color. It goes from like pinky purple to green and it's so magical. The retail on this was $69.95, but at 75% off, it was about $17 and some change. I didn't have any coupons, unfortunately, but it was already so cheap. So that was the one thing I got from this store. Let me make sure I get it put back in here correctly. So like I said, that was a 75% off. Goodness, I don't know how this is supposed to go in here. Right this way. Do I have it in the wrong way? And I hate the sound of styrofoam. Okay, I'll figure that out later. So that was everything I got from that store, and they were nice and gave me it in um, the little box for easy storage. It just says this Beauty Avenue slash Roman Incorporated. Interested. So yeah, I got that for $17 and some change. Now flash forward to today. Today is the 29th. Like I said, I went to the Bath and Body Works outlet. Um, I did have a buy online pickup and store order. And this was the only place that had this around me for Bopis because I didn't want to miss out on it. But it was the 75% off coffee and whiskey cologne. This one says warm fragrance with a hint of sweetness inspired by the classic combination of Coffee and bold Irish whiskey. This was $39.50, but at 75% off, it was about $10. Since it was a buy online pickup and store order, I don't have my receipt for that, but that's okay. Um, this is what it looks like, and it smells so good. Honestly, I might use this for myself. It smells really, really good. That wasn't the only thing I got at the outlet. Oh, I also found some like new stuff. Um, like some new three wicks and some new wallflowers and car rent clips. I'll throw those up on the screen now. But other than the little um, cologne, I got two things. These were the only two things I bought. Um, and they were the only two they had. They were $2 wallflowers. I think this scent is really pretty and perfect for spring. But I got two of the Honeysuckle and Peach Spritz. This is Honeysuckle Blooms, Juicy Peaches, and Orange Zest. So I thought this would be good for the spring and summertime. So that was all that I got from the outlet. The outlet was pretty bad. And one of these wallflowers is leaking already. So I'll make sure to save that um, upright. But those were $4 and some change. And then I went to one last store and I did get three things. Um, my total at this store was $9.95 because I did get a um, $4.95 body care. I did the math and it like, is only going to save me like 40 cents to wait for the 4.95 um item to go down to 75 percent off so there really wasn't a point and then i did get two 75 percent off hand soaps which ended up being two dollars and 24 cents so i grabbed myself a golden citrus and vanilla i did haul this already but i ended up giving that to my mom this is sun kissed orange autumn blooms and creamy vanilla i wanted one for myself and then from the same collection i got white orchid woods and this is frosted orchids Bright bergamot and white woods because I don't think I have my other bag here too. I didn't get this one. I got Harvest Gathering the other day from that collection. And I think that was it from that collection. Oh shoot. Which one did I give my mom? Now I'll have to ask my mom which one I ended up giving her. 
Oh, I gave my mom the sunblock citrus. That's okay. So I have two of them. And then I wanted to smell this white orchid woods because it sounds amazing. Let's see. Oh, that's very nice. My mom would probably like this one too. Um, a good little fruity floral moment. So we have white orchid woods. And then last but not least, the $4.95 item I got was Forever Sunshine because they barely had any left at the store I went to. This is golden apricot, pink peonies, vanilla musk, and a hint of praline. Oh, that's really good. I do like that praline note mixed with the, um, the praline mixed with the apricot is really, really nice. Is this going to be my new favorite? No, but it's good. It's good. I might get a body lotion when those hit 75% off, but do I need to stock up on it? Probably not. But that is all for my end of week one semi-annual sale haul other than my like big haul from day one. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and let me know how your semi-annual sale experience has been. I know a lot of people are really disappointed and I can see that because usually I get way more. The only reason why I've spent so much is because I found that luminary. Without the luminary, I don't even think... I'd be at like $110 at the end of the first week, which normally I spend that on the first day. But yeah, that is all. Um, like I said, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts on this semi-annual sale. And if you like seeing my face, just remember about the Waterworks content, make sure you consider hitting that subscribe button because it's free to you. Helps note so, so much. And you guys can always change your mind later. Thanks again, guys, for watching today's video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.